in a state of honor, present to you the President of the United States. I've had enough of the slander our nation has been throwing towards Family Guy. Seth MacFarlane didn't die on 9-11 for a reason, and are we just going to hate on a nigga just because some white boys think they're too good for Peter, for Joe Swanson? Today, before Congress, I address this fact. In Season 17, Episode 8 of The Simpsons, we see a poster claiming my man Peter Griffin is wanted for plagiarism. Defamation called a quote-unquote joke, which Fox allowed. But in Season 6, Episode 2 of Family Guy, they had to censor a hilarious joke where Glenn Quagmire of B. Bush fame seduced Marge in his usual funny and wacky way. Why is Fox playing favorites? Why can't my nigga Seth catch a break? He's a genius, an artist, and a sex icon. Sure, Glenn has had his fair share of controversy in the past, but all of us boys from the hood know that we've all hit up some of that inappropriate pussy from time to time. And speaking of representing boys from the hood, are we simply supposed to forget about the Cleveland show? The truest form of black entertainment was ripped from my fellow bloods out there in the trap, slinging chronic and crank, popping caps and sipping 40s. Cleveland was an icon, a role model all young niggas could aspire to be like Eminem, but actually black. Family Guy is actually funny as fuck for real. Y'all motherfuckers just sociology majors like... like Like, imagine you're going to the clam with the guys and Peter starts farting and shit. If only gas station weed was able to live up to the false promises of an instant escape to Quahog, Rhode Island. But I ask my fellow Americans, and to all you before me, to not allow this continued assault on good old-fashioned values. While they push for increased violence in film, with smut and lewd content on television. And that's why I was elected president because I am a man who positively can do all the things that make us laugh and cry. I intend to be your family guy.